Captain, priority one message from Starfleet. Jean-Luc, we've just received some very disturbing information about the leader of the Borg invasion. I already know. This for Mong. An honorless dog like you will never rule the Empire. That is where you are wrong, Worf. Now that I possess the sword of Kalis, the Klingon throne is mine. I will see to it that day never comes. Admiral Sela, sensors confirm. It is the Omega Particle. Prepare the containment field and hail the nearest Borg vessel. Tell them we wish to negotiate a deal. Receiving a transmission from the Borg cube. On screen. Locutus. Picard, lower your shields and prepare to be assimilated. If you are truly who you appear to be, you must know that I will not comply. You will comply. Your defensive capabilities are no match for us. Your culture will adapt to service ours. Resistance is and always has been futile. weapons on that vessel. Fire. Welcome back. It's been a while since I've made a Let's Play, and I felt like having a go at another classic RTS. So this is Star Trek Armada. Um, I'm running the 1.3 patch, which is a fan patch. It's an old game, so there might be some sort of little inconsistencies. I sometimes find dropped inputs and stuff, so bear with that. But without further ado, I'm going to start with the Federation campaign and the mission Premonitions. Captain's log, stardate 53550.8. 
With the Dominion War over and matter stabilizing in the Alpha Quadrant, the Enterprise is helping to re-establish an outpost in the Barisa sector. Though we are not expecting any conflicts, there have been rumors of renegade Dominion ships in the area who have refused to accept the Dominion Federation Treaty. The Enterprise is being sent to protect the outpost should any hostilities arise. Okay, here we go. We'll get some objectives popping up in a second. So we need to build a starbase, build a mining station, and the Enterprise must survive. Hint, use a construction ship to build stations. <laughs> okay, so let's uh, control Adjust group heading. one. Set a new and course. meanwhile, let's get this guy building. Confirm, Starfleet. And we're going to use on our first control group to hunt Armed down ready. some enemies. Some Alter Dominion course. foes. Adjust heading. Okay. Alter course. Alter course. So we're mostly going to be Elm, encountering a ship called hit. the Destroyer, which are the little sort of bug-shaped gem headar ships Elm, from Deep Space Nine. Hit. Which tended to do the uh, kamikaze runs. The Dominion ships are powering their weapons. Go to red alert. Help. There's uh, New course one downside, I would say, that uh, Alter course. to the Help. ships how they implemented them in this game. They don't have the sort of Arm kamikaze maneuver. Uh, bear with me, I am just going to pause and readjust the volume levels a second. Okay, hopefully that's better. Adjust heading. Armed and ready. And station complete. I was just wondering when Helm, the station might no be complete. Oh, let's get them All going. Let's build a star base. Now, technically it doesn't Confirm matter here, but if you have a blue outline around the star base, that means you're near a planet. Helm, new course and heading. your star bases will generate crew Alter faster. Course. So you've got two resources, you've got Dilithium, which is your primary Fire. shipbuilding All one, weapons. and your crew. Which is kind of, well, secondary resource. Uh, there are also offices, which is effectively pop cap. Adjust heading. Um, and we'll get abilities later. Where you can t transport, Arm teleport. <laughs> Just Elm, do a teleportation in Star Trek. It's transportation. On standby. Um, and yeah, we're just going to be hunting Elm, down stuff. It's one of those heading. early intro missions, Elm, which new course heading. isn't the most happening in terms of Adjust heading. things going on. Adjust heading. But, Armed you know, and ready. Adjust heading. There isn't even a tutorial, so I guess we had to Helm, start the first heading. mission off, assuming that person playing Armed it would and ready. next to nothing Alter about course. the game. Um, and as you may, I've played Armed through this game before, um, and as you may have noticed, I've got some test Enemy missions before, engaged. so I do know roughly how this mission is going to pan out. So I'm going to sort of drift towards the top corner. Armed and ready. Um, how close is Starbase to doing? So if I hover over this, it will give you an initial percentage and then actually tell me the approximate number of seconds. I assume approximate because you can change the game speed, Make which is All sections on uh, nice of the thing to reflect that, Armed I suppose. Um, most heading. strategy games, you just understand Adjust that heading. seconds are not seconds. Adjust heading. All sections Because on I usually play it on a much faster speed than, you know, quote-unquote normal. Helm, new course heading. Um, yeah, the graphics are a little bit Adjust better heading. because of the 1.3 patch. I mean, obviously, there's only so much you can do with this engine, but the Armed ships do look very nice. Armed I mean, the Sovereign and Akira is a nice anyway. But oh. station, sensors are picking up Dominion attack ships heading this way. So, All hands to battle stations. Let me not talk over Jean-Luc Picard. So yeah, obviously we uh, triggered the next part of the mission uh, when you have finished. So we just got to round up some of the Dominion ships. Currently at this phase, it is only the destroyers. Fire, full burst. Uh, but there is actually Dash a fairly report. decent variety enemy of enemy engaged. ships. Uh, even sort of, for lack of a better term, NPC ships, non-faction ships. Helm, new course which is a nice touch. Oh, are there any more Dominion? Helm, new course heading. Uh, I'm not worried about them reaching the base because the star bases are pretty tanky. There we go. There's our fellas. Fire all weapons. Okay. Armed and ready. I do like Armed and ready. how they have all names on generated for the ships as well. Helm, new course heading. And are Armed there any more Dominion holdouts to hunt down? All sections on standby. I think they are sort of set to attack all towards our standby. position. Because it Armed never seemed ready. to matter Adjust where I go on the map. 
All they sections seem on to standby. find me regardless. All right. sections on standby. Armed and ready. Alter course. Armed and ready. Alter course. Uh, there are a few orders as well, so if I press O or click on the orders button, there's various different things. Some alert settings, you can self-destruct, uh, you can guard an area. Oh, God. Well, I don't know what God does exactly if I hover over. Follow and protect another vessel. Oh, I have to target something. Um, Armed and ready. And the, probably the most useful ones are your scout, Armed search and, and destroy. And you can actually decommission ships if you don't need them anymore. Adjust heading. Problem with scout and search and destroy is it will disperse my ships. Armed and ready. So. Adjust heading. Where Adjust are heading. these other dimensions? Maybe I need to move towards the center. Maybe everything I said before about it not mattering where I was was a load of nonsense. Oh, well, let's see. Keep Helm, an eye on the mini map because they show up a nice bright Adjust purple. Heading. Alter course. Adjust heading. Oh, I wonder if we're on the Adjust other side heading. of this nebula. Oh, hello. There we go. Bring us in a weapon. Maybe we'll just take a while to spawn. Enemy and pretty sure we'd check that direction. Captain, the area is secure from Dominion ships, but I am reading some strange temporal distortions in the area. On screen. Call. This is Captain Thaddeus Deming of the USS Premonition. We are under attack by the board to any ships in the area. This is the USS Premonition. Sir, we lost the transmission. Data, locate the origin of that transmission and lay in a course. There we go. So we need to save the permission, the premonition. Which uh, obviously requires a premonition must survive, and we need the Enterprise to survive. Not going to be much of a challenge here. Uh, again, first mission. But we should hop to it. New course in. Uh, again, it's currently mostly ships lining up and fighting each other uh, in this mission. You can actually activate a director's cut, which I believe has the ships kind of fly around of their own volition. I'm going to pull him out and see if I can get some hull damage on a different one. Yeah, there All we go, micro. This is what you came for. Some Fire. intense uh, Akira-class micro. But yeah, uh, as I was saying before, it's quite nice that you get a little designation for each individual report. ship. Um, and then All that weapon. should be all they wrote once we... You can reduce the crew and reduce them to a wreck, but obviously they can also be destroyed by all the Captain, systems and hold We're receiving a hail from the permanent on screen. The legendary Captain Picard. It's an honor to meet you, sir. Captain Deming, you and your ship do not appear in the Starfleet database. Do you have an explanation for this? That is because it does not yet exist. I've come from the future to warn the Federation of an impending Borg invasion. We must act quickly if we are to stop them. Captain Deming, Starfleet has strict regulations which prohibit tampering with the current timeline. I have no intention Captain! of- Captain! Within the hour, the Borg will attack and assimilate Starbase 612. Its destruction was marked as the first step in the Borg invasion that eventually took over the Alpha Quadrant. The card where I come from the Federation barely exists. Vulcan, Bajor, Kronos, Earth, they're all assimilated planets. This is our last hope, Captain. If you don't help us, the Alpha Quadrant will fall to the Borg. Very well, Captain. I will pursue this matter. Lieutenant, send a message to Starfleet Command informing them of our situation. Ensign Lucetti, set a course for Starbase 612. Engage. There we go. Um, so that was mission number one. Uh, next mission will be Paradise Revisited. So we've encountered the USS Premonition, a ship out of time. Hope you have a good day, and I will hopefully see you in the next one. Thanks. Bye.